Hey everybody, welcome back to Bruce's Bees. I'm back out here in Midland City and today we're gonna have a quick little video. If you remember back in the early fall, I treated these colonies with Apigard. I've been having some issues with mites and we had some mixed results out here. On October 31st, I did some spot checks on these colonies out here and most of them were well within threshold, but two of them graded above threshold at 10 mites. And so I decided to go ahead and treat using the new Instant Vape Oxalic Acid Vaporizer that I got from Rob up at Larabi's. The product worked phenomenally, but now we're gonna see what the results are. So what I'm gonna to do today is just go into those two colonies that had a 10 mite count and see what the numbers are. Uh, just a simple test to see the effectiveness of oxalic acid vapor. This is not a scientific experiment, but I'm just kind of eager to see, kind of curious to see what the results are in these two colonies after using oxalic acid vapor for four weeks. You can see this is the first one that tested on October 31st, 10 mites. The bees are not super active today. It's just kind of a dreary day, but you can see we do have some bees in this colony here. So the first thing I see here is we got a lot of honey in this top box. Let's pull out a couple frames. Don't see a lot of bees. See, look at that, honey. Not looking like a super strong colony though, but we'll see what we got. Well, All right, we do have some, some brood right here, some larva over here too. We got a fair number of beetles in here. My goodness, look at the beetles. That's aggravating. Yeah, I'm not super impressed with this right now. This colony will not be going to California. There's the queen right here. So we're gonna set her aside. Go ahead and just See what we have. All right. I'll shake them for a minute. See where the results are. Let's see where the results are. I only see one mite. So that's a big improvement. However, the hive is so weak, a little disappointed in that, but we do have a great improvement in the mite count. All right, here's the other one that had a mite count of 10. If you can see right there, the bee inspector was out here uh, four days ago and he did a alcohol wash on it, I believe, and he got a count of three. So let's see what we get with the Don Ultra uh, wash. Plenty of bees down there. This hive looks much healthier. We got plenty of honey in there. I can just tell by looking. Yeah, that's a nice population in here. Look at that frame. This is a medium frame in a deep box. <laughs> oh yeah, a healthy colony here. Nice brood pattern, pretty good population. I see eggs all down through here. There's the queen right there. Queen is right here with the yellow dot. We were lucky enough to see queens on both of those. You know, this is a good looking colony here for this time of year. All right, let's see what we have. I'm counting two. Looks good. Well, if those two colonies are any indication, I'll say that oxalic acid vapor this time of the year is a good thing. And I think the instant bat was effective in treating these bees. Now remember the one colony, the population is not good, lots of beetles in there. So obviously if the population is low, without much brood, then the oxalic acid vapor is gonna knock out the mites. This one right back here though, good looking strong colony and uh, only two mites, well within threshold. Uh, obviously this is not a scientific study, we just checked out two colonies and so uh, you can take that for what it's worth, but I thought it'd be fun just to kinda come and follow up. Hope you enjoyed it. 
If you want to see my instant VAP review, you can watch that video right here. Y'all take care, be safe, and we'll catch you on the next one.